Or did you get a wrong number? Please leave a message after the shriek. Joker voicemail parody. Check. It exists. Batman the Animated Series from the 90s. It was the episode when Hugo Strange found out Bruce Wayne was Batman. He called Joker and we got to hear the voicemail. It exists. Go check it out. What the heck am I supposed to do next? The mail's in? Oh yeah, I love how I give myself reminders on what's supposed to happen in these videos. But, new intro. What is up guys, I'm Malahu Guerrero, aka Marvelous and Mexipino, and I really need a haircut. But I should really get out of my pajamas actually. But then again, I have been staying in my pajamas all day for a while now because, you know, oh yeah, I've been stuck at home! But seriously, about that haircut... <laughs> But I am sad that we got these long summer days because, um, yeah, I hate sunshine. Or at least the blind, hot, scorching, blazing sunshine. Very different from when I was a kid when I was always like, Why is it so cold? Can't we turn up the heater to like 90? But nowadays, I will 100% be like, Ah, that is bright! I don't like it! Not gonna lie, I feel like that's gonna be so many people coming out of quarantine. But there are some things that have stuck with me since I was a kid. Which brings me to the topic of this video. I mean, for some reason, for some weird reason, we all have things that we still do. Habits, likes, dislikes, that kind of stick with us for the rest of our lives. I mean, from picking your nose, to snoring, to biting your nails. I mean, we all got them. And yes, I do know people who still do those things. But for me, it's stuff like putting ice in my ramen, getting pissed when I hit a wrong note, and randomly running into the corners of things. But don't worry, I'm only gonna focus on the weird stuff that I still got. Brace yourselves. Number one. So this is something I like to call Wonderland Syndrome. It's, I'm sure there's a medical term somewhere, but you know, I just haven't researched much on what I have, even though I'm like 20 now. Yeah. But anyway, so I will be sitting, standing, doing whatever, and all of a sudden I will completely get sucked out of whatever I'm doing, and I will just completely start thinking about whatever. Now I know you're probably like, everyone does this, but no, no. With me, it's, I completely just tune everything out and whatever I'm thinking of, whether it's a memory or like whatever I was watching the night before on TV, that will become my reality. I will completely lose focus. I will completely lose sight of what's around me, what's my actual surroundings. And I will either just start walking in a weird direction or I will keep doing what I'm doing, but I'll have this weird just look on my face. And hey, I might even end up in the weirdest of places when I finally snap out of it. I mean, this happens while I eat, while I do chores, while I drive. How have I not been pulled over yet? <laughs> but moving on. Number two. 
So according to everyone who's ever met me, I don't walk, I float. I don't know why I do it. Honestly, I just don't. In fact, everyone who lived in my dorm wing lot two years ago, they made a meme comparing me to Dracula. They kept saying, Elihu, you just glide, not, you're not normal, you don't walk like a normal person, you just float. So literally, most days, in the morning, I have to prepare and practice how to walk like a normal person. I'm so weird, I know. Number three. So that is all I have for you guys today. Hopefully next time I... <laughs> ah! So I will dream that I will wake up, get ready, get dressed, you know, all that. And I will head out the door, maybe even drive to school, show up at the school even maybe, and then I will just wake up and realize I was so, this makes me so mad because you have no idea how many times I've been late to school and other things, other important things because of the stupid habit I have. And sometimes it'll be so bizarre that, you know, I'll know it's a dream, but then it won't be so bizarre that it'll seem super normal that I'll be like, oh wait, this is real life maybe? So I'm always in question every morning if I'm actually awake. Like, am I awake right now? Are you even awake right now? So that's all I have for you guys today because I have a lot more. Like, the list literally goes on forever and ever. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I know I've been forgetting for like weeks now, but the music video I was in, uh, Mike Tompkins' video that came like a month ago, I just wanted to say thank you because it gave me something to do while I, you know, we were all stuck at home and it was really fun getting to do you know, a little bit of choreography and sing a bit for the music video. But you guys can go check it out, I'll probably leave the link in the description below. But again, thank you Mike Tompkins and look for this view. Until next time, bye guys. Ah! <laughs>